So Paul, how was it today in quite tough conditions heat-wise? Uh, yeah, no, I think the lads put a real shift in. and Obviously, I got the chance to lead the lads out today, which was, um, well, I turned up this morning and really happy to hear that. Um, but yeah, we, we got out there and all the bowlers and even the fielders, like, like you said, um, Jack Blatherwick and Luke Wood on the field all day today, knowing they weren't going to bowl. Um, and everyone just put in such a shift for, for, for each other. Was there anybody that actually stood out for you and that made you stop and sort of look for a moment? Um, I don't even think I could pick one out. Obviously, Chappie, Chappie's figures there um, were really good and he, he bowled in, in the difficult times of the game as well. Which um, So, yeah, so, so I, could, I could pick out all of, this, all of the bowlers throughout different parts of the game and say this is when he did well. Obviously, Bowley and Footy were really good first up. Um, and obviously un unfortunate not to get a few more wickets in that first session. Um, but yeah, like I said, I could pick out different moments from each of the bowlers. So you mentioned how great it was to captain the side today. How was it for you bowling though, back after injury effectively? Yeah, I suppose it's really my first proper run out. Uh, and yeah, thankfully I, I had no problems. And um, to be honest, I was looking forward to the end of the day after about eight overs, but um, it was great to get them overs under my belt. And moving into tomorrow, what are we going to be uh, asking those batters to come out and show us tomorrow? Well, I think I think we've got a fair idea of what to expect after we've bowled all day on this wicket. Um, it's a tough wicket to bowl on um, and, and the outfield's fast. So, um, like I said, I think we did a great job to keep them where we are and I'm sure the batters uh, know exactly what to expect tomorrow.